Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be filming a DIY. It's not related to Christmas in any way, shape or form, but they're really nice ideas for gifts. I'm on FaceTime to Leah, who is one of my best friends. And she requested this video when she first found out I was doing YouTube and I had these little craft bits. So I'm doing this video for Leah and I hope all you guys enjoy it as well. So first of all, I've just got these old jars. So I have all different shapes and sizes. And I use these as storage uh, like jars. So in here I have all my cotton pads which I use for my makeup remover. And this is just, I just drew this on in Sharpie. So all the supplies are really easy to get hold of. And then this one I use for just colouring pens and pencils. And all of this is just from a craft shop and you can also get it from Poundland. So as long as you've just got some old jars that have been washed out, you can do these really easily. My next little jar is a sl slimmer jar and I use it to put some of my old makeup brushes in. I don't use these anymore but I store them in this pretty jar with this decorative tape around it. So again you can just get it from any craft shop or the pound shop. This one is an old jar of baby food and in here I've just put tissue paper in and some sequins. So when it catches the light it's really pretty because it glitters but I think this is a great gift idea and it's really quick and simple and cheap as well. Next one I have this little tea light holder. Now it looks better with a small tea light but I can't find any small tea light so I've put my Yankee candle in and it is sweet vanilla. So this is just again just diamantes and a little paper heart. This is really easy. <laughs> it's got a whole box of tea lights but never mind. Um, but this is really cute and I've done a few of these and I have use them as gifts just because they're really cute and simple and cheap to make so and they look really effective as well so these diamantes just from the pound shop and then the paper heart I bought but you can easily make it because it's just out of paper. Next I have an old tin can and with this I got my dad to drill some holes in it and it's got the initial C on it for my first name and then I've just used tissue paper to cover it and for this I put a little light in it. I would show you but I don't have uh, a light at hand. Mm. So in here I've just put my iPod and it's just got a, the clock screen but it lights up. So it looks really nice and you can use any colour tissue paper you want and any number of layers. I think I might go over this again as the tin has started to grow. So I would definitely recommend these for gift ideas because they're really easy and it's really easy to get hold of the supplies and, you think, and the things you need for this because all of this is just old tins and old jars that have been washed out and then just like craft supplies that I've found around the house or that I've had to go out and buy from like the pound shop but it's really cheap and it's really easy. And Leah, did you like this video? Yes. Leah liked this video so I did this video for Leah because I knew she really wanted me to do it so I FaceTimed her whilst I was doing it and then she can be part of it as well. So I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you would like Leah to be in another one of my videos but in person next to me then comment down below and say that you want Leah in my videos and yeah I really hope you enjoyed this mini DIY and please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.